because I was thinking that God was far away from me and I needed to do many things in order for Him to love me. But you know what? God is not condemnation. You know, His grace, His His love, and in, in this way God loved the world that He sent His Son to die for us to cover all of our mistakes. Are you full of mistakes? Are you full of, 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 of many bad things that you have done in your life? Well, there's somebody who paid the price for you. Because we are dead in sin. We are far away from God. The relationship that God designed for man was to have a real personal relationship with Him. This was broken in the Garden of Eden. You know, but in this way God loved the world that He sent His Son so that He died to cover, to clean, to pay the price for your sins and for my sins, for your mistakes, for my mistakes. And, and this is such a great love that He made us. He made this for us to be children of God and to have again a personal, real relationship with Him. And you know, I am a testimony. I have a beautiful relationship with Him. He is with me, you know, all the time. Him and me, we are one. And I am so happy that I have found this treasure in my life. And I have found the real meaning, the real purpose. For, like I said, for many years I look for this purpose in tradition, in religion, you know. You can go to, to many churches, you can know a lot about tradition, about religion, about many things. But that doesn't mean that you really know God. You can be inside a church and you can be dead inside. You can go and do many good things, even give your money to the poor, do everything, study a lot, get a lot of, uh, a lot of, a lot of uh, degrees, in, even in, in big important universities, have a good job, have money, have a good clothes, traveling, have a good lifestyle. But you know, if you don't have a real relationship with God, you're dead. And the, 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 this sin, this dead life, independent away from God, produces death, eternal death. And I'm not just talking about the normal biological death. I am talking about the spiritual death and going to hell. But he loved us so much that he wanted to restore this broken relationship with the man and give us life again. You know, I used to look for this in tradition and in religion, but it's not there, my friends, it's not there. It's looking for Him, for Jesus, for a real relationship. It is believing that He died for you, that He died for your sins, to cover your mistakes, to make you new, and He resurrected. He didn't stay there in the grave. He resurrected on the third day. That's the power of the resurrection. And with this power, He gives us a new life. He makes us new, born again people. You know? And this is the real gospel. And if you believe it, this is the only way of salvation. This is the real meaning of life. I used to I used to look for love. I was in lack of love, you know, and I used to look for love in different ways uh, to, to find love in my life. Even going to a church, I was empty inside of me, you know, but he filled me with his love, with his real love and power. He healed me from a lot of illnesses and sickness I had in my body. He set me free, you know, I had a lot of demonic oppressions and obsessions in my life, but He set me free. And in this same way that He saved me, He can save you. All what you need to do is believe in your heart. This is by grace. You can believe in your heart that He died for you on the cross. You can believe that He resurrected and He paid the price for your sins. I invite you to come. We want to pray for you. We want to pray for you to be saved. We want to pray for you if you're feeling sick, if you need freedom. We want to pray for you in this afternoon. Uh, we are from Church of Power. You can find us on Facebook. 
Uh, you can uh, just look for Church of Power or in, uh, in Polish, Koshal Matze. I don't know if I'm pronouncing it correctly. Uh, but I invite you to have a real life. I am a testimony. I am alive. I have real life. I have purpose. I have full wholeness and happiness in Jesus. Amen.